Hi, I'm Paul. Normally you don't expect to see me wearing this sort of gear sitting next to a bike like this. I'm much more a road bike kind of guy. Not too often do I end up getting in the mud. Every now and then a bike arrives at BRM and DRD HQ that is perfect for me as an intermediate trail rider. This bike here is the Honda CRF 250X. The 250 meaning it's a 250cc four stroke. The X meaning it's perfect for enduro and trail. We're here at Maramura Forest. Let's see how we go. Okay, so I spent the day on the Honda CRF 250X and to be quite honest, I was uh, pleasantly surprised, although I don't know why I was surprised because I've ridden this bike a number of times and each time it just amazes me with how easy and user friendly it really is. Now guys really do like to go for big bore bikes. They like to get the 450, they like that um, twisting the throttle and just having unlimited power there. But Personally for me, I actually prefer the smaller 250cc machine. To be honest, it's probably not that much lighter than the 450, but it's just a bit more manageable. And when you start getting tired, which when you haven't ridden dirt bikes for a long time, you do quite quickly, the engine doesn't overwhelm you. You don't find yourself getting into trouble with that throttle. The bike itself, as I say, hasn't really changed much. Um, but to be honest, it didn't really need to. Um, the frame's fantastic, it's modern. Okay, the engine isn't fuel injected, but it doesn't seem to make a difference. Um, okay, if you were doing a ride where you're going up to high altitudes, well, then the addition of fuel injection might be a bonus, but to be quite honest, the carb seems to work just good enough. Funnily enough, when uh, Chris wheeled the CRF out of the van, just the addition of the black wheels did make quite a difference. Um, and we all sat there and look at the, looked at the 250 and the 450 and were like, hmm, they're actually quite nice. Um, the styling is up to date. Um, it's a shame it doesn't have an enduro computer, but to be quite honest, you can buy them from your local bike shop and it might set you back a hundred bucks or something. Um, so really that's no biggie. Everything else is as it should be, works perfectly. The brakes are good, but again, they don't overwhelm you. And it's just a pleasant bike to ride. I would definitely recommend one if you're not riding dirt bikes every weekend, if you go out occasionally and do all sorts of different riding. You might go and do Desert Storm, you might have a hand at an enduro. You know, this bike will turn its hand to anything. Now here at Maramurua, as most of you might know, there's heaps of roots, heaps of lumps, heaps of bumps, ruts from when they've been running the three day enduro. Um, it really is quite a lumpy, gnarly terrain. And to be honest, having suspension that's soft and soaks up the bumps really is a bonus. Overall, the CRF 250X really is an accomplished machine. It'll do pretty much everything you want it to. It'll do everything I want it to. It looks the part, which, face it, is quite important. Um, and I would certainly be happy to have one sitting in my garage. 